You know, they have done this African Union passports. Passports, yeah. yes. Okay. I haven't uh, got one yet. I don't know why. Uh, no, they have to give you one. You know, yeah, definitely. They, they I mean, it's better for yeah. you because if you now see my passports, I carry six to seven passports because of visas. Okay, and even though I'm an investor, but I need uh, visas in almost 38 countries out of 55 or so. So now they have issued us with the African Union passport. About a few of us who've gotten the first. Three of us. Maybe how, three. How or much four. do I have to pay for that? No, I didn't pay anything. Come on, I mean, <coughs> no, no, no. But, but look, I mean, I haven't got one. I mean, I, I support the African you Union. I, they didn't give me one. <laughs> <laughs> You must have paid something for those guys. No, 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 okay. no. We got it, it is in uh, Addis Ababa at the African okay. Union. So I've got one. But let me tell you this. The one that I have, um, I went to South Africa quite OK. And uh, I think you the carry, new. carrying a Nigerian passport or South African passport? No, 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 carrying African Union passport. African Union passport. Yes, but this same African Union passport, you know, I'm sorry, you know, since uh, we're all talking very openly, but I was invited by the president of Angola to come and, uh, you know, see him. And, uh, you know, I had to go. Normally, I don't travel much during fasting period, but I went. And uh, when I went there, I had to be given a visa on African Union passport. Maybe uh, there is uh, fees for the visa? No, There's no fees? it's not about fees. That, when you say African Union passport, it means that you should move some money. everywhere, no. free yeah, of charge. I thought that was the agreement. <clears throat> yes, okay. so I had to apply for visa, and intentionally when I applied for the visa, I also applied on African Union passport, and I gave them that one to sample it. Maybe you need to send the pictures that to Musa Faki to say No, 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 I'm yeah. going to send it to Vera. She did, she did not issue the passport. I she mean, did issue, yeah, but she should Most go of her kids she, she, said, what is this? I mean, is that useful? No, I think she's in Ethiopia. And uh, since she's, she, she's, well, she's dragging all of us to champion this uh, CFTA, so she needs to go and sort out these hanging issues. Then we'll all go out with her. You know, Nigeria will sign tomorrow. I'll tell you, I'll tell you something. <laughs> I, I, in this trouble thing, I tell you honestly, I mean, I also have, besides <coughs> Sudanese passport, I have a British passport. I cannot use Sudanese passport anyway for obvious reasons. So I travel with British passport. I go everywhere. I get my visa in South Africa. At, 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 if you go to any other country. Because I say, hey, I'm British. I don't look British, but I, I have a British passport. So it's like this. But more, your own is even easier or very simple. I've uh, been to most of these countries where somebody who is my assistant, okay, who take notes in the meeting, yeah. he will be allowed in, and they will not allow me in. An African country? An African country, yes. Okay, thank you very much. I think that's... <laughs> <laughs> what do you do with those guys? <laughs> anyway. Well, I think I... we need political will to be able to implement yeah. most of these things that we're signing. And, you know, I think in Africa, if you will allow British, European, uh, you know, I mean, Americans to get in there on visa, I mean, you know, having visa on arrival, you should allow all Africans to get in there with no visas. You know, and I keep telling them, I was on a panel with the uh, Prime Minister of, uh, you know, Mali, and I asked him, I said, Mr. Prime Minister, the people who are causing trouble in the other part of your country, did they come through the airports? No. No, those guys, they don't need a visa. Boko Haram, that's <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> they don't need a visa, you know, so <clears throat> whether you give, so, you know, it's better you go and concentrate on you the trouble. You go from the yes. exactly, you go they just go through with their tanks. Five kilometers from the airport yes, across. Yes, with yeah. their tanks, and they come into the cities with no, uh, yeah. you know, yes. So I, that's the, uh, you know. One thing.